What's up, YouTube? It's your girl, Nikisha, and I'm back with another video. I know I'm kind of close to the camera right now, but I'm walking to my car, and I got my hands full right now. Getting ready to go to work. Day 4 of 11. Give me a second, y'all. We're going to drive to the mailbox. I have to pass it anyway today. So try to the good old mailbox oh no not my hair okay hold on y'all put y'all right there oh, okay y'all messed up my little hair gotta fix my bun all right <clears throat> how y'all doing today how y'all doing today it's hat is hell outside but today i got my tea and i got me a smoothie a pineapple peach pineapple peach strawberry uh smoothie today and, oh and mango yeah i didn't eat nothing all day and then i got my lunch my um chicken over rice and broccoli big chicken but yeah we're gonna drive to this good old mailbox first of all pack that yeah girl it's hot no it's just around the corner i gotta pass it anyway so ain't no point in me walking the opposite way and then walking back and then getting in the car so we're gonna drive to it real quick Again, that my car top is not as high as my old car so I be like putting my buns up heck of high and forgetting that you know but y'all let me tell y'all a small secret I know I keep talking about gas prices but let me tell y'all Sam's Club gas is the truth I'm still on a full tank of gas and I filled up two days ago straw fell down. No. <laughs> I need a straw. My straw. It fell, y'all. Let me stop before I crash into somebody's car. Hold on, y'all. Oh, man, and it fell again. Dang it. straw but I don't feel like stopping nowhere to try to get a straw so I do not have a full face on today I'm still not putting makeup on my face I did just do my eyebrows though because I just felt like with my bun being this high I had to do something so I decided to do my eyebrows not my full face but today is day four of 11 and I'm tired. Like I didn't get out the bed, I ain't even gonna lie. I didn't get out the bed until like 12.30. Cause I didn't feel like it. I just, I was tired. I was like legit tired. So I didn't have anything to do this morning. So I just was like, whatever. But um, I'm excited for my days off <laughs> whenever they come. Um, it is a weekend, so you know, I don't get those.
those often. But I've been thinking about changing my profession, y'all. Don't get me wrong. I love what I do. I love customer service. I love talking to the people, you know. I love... I really do love what I do. But... It's, I don't know if it's like the company I think I'm like burnt out like I don't really know like I'm just burnt out and I'm like over it honestly and I was talking to babe about it and he pretty much was like he knows that I want to go back to school to do some things and um, I'm thinking about going to school to become a CNA or something in that field and they have some little programs out here that um, I'll be basically going to school for like three or four months. And I was thinking about just doing that, you know. Um, but we're trying to save up a little bit more money because I'm going to end up either cutting my hours down at work or quitting altogether. Um, so we're trying to figure out, you know, what we're going to do um, as far as that goes. Um, but gas is three cents in um but it's just a lot like i'm just this job stresses me out and honestly like with one kid i was already stressed out just for a simple fact that it's like i don't get to spend as much time as i want to with her and now that i have two kids i feel like i don't spend enough time with them um because of my job like I have to pick and like basically it's like my job over everything it's like it's my oldest you know she's in school I have like some of her games volleyball games I wasn't able to go to just for the simple fact that like I had to be at work and um that's the sacrifice that I had to make because I have to support them um but at the same time like I just really want a job that I can like not feel like I'm choosing something over my kids and that I'm able to do more things with them as far as like going on trips or you know fa planning family outings and stuff like that because right now I'm not able to really do that because this job doesn't care about nothing but themselves period and I'm gonna say it and I don't care and um they kind of just you know don't really care what you want to do and um it, I, I see it like affecting my family period my little family that I you know have going on and it's like oh you know we get invited to a barbecue or something I can't go everybody else can go but I can't go so then you know they'll probably end up not going depending on the situation just because I can't go which isn't fair you know um but Go ahead. Um, but um, I'm not just quite sure. I don't know. It's just I'm irritated with it. And I just honestly just feel like I'm tired of choosing something over my family. And I just want to do something that I'm more, I'm able to, you know, make more money and be able to. Um, oh, my God. They parked so messed up. And I don't want to park next to him because it looks like they're going to hit my car. Um, but I want to work up somewhere where I can make more money. And that I, and, uh, that I can um, make more money and be able to spend more time with my, with my kids and my family. It's 36 right now. And... Um, I just feel like I can't do that here at this job and I'm over it and I see that at this job if you're not kissing ass you're not gonna get full time you're not gonna they'll they'll let you top out but they won't give you full time if you're not kissing ass and I'm not doing that so at this point and I'm tired of like honestly like there's some people that just don't pull their weight. I'm tired of picking up people's slack because I don't, you know what I'm saying? I, I just, it's just irritating. There's a lot of things that I could say, but I'm not. 
Um, so I'm just irritated, honestly, and I'm over it. And uh, it's time for me to move on. Uh, I was thinking about it while I was pregnant working here. And I had decided that I really wasn't going to come back. I was like, nope, I'm not going to come back. I'm just going to find another job. <clears throat> but other things happened to where I wasn't able to do that. Um, I was, you know, so I decided, okay, I'll come back. And maybe it's just, you know, maybe it was just my pregnancy hormones or whatnot tripping. And no, not at all. So at this point, I'm completely over it. I realize that I'm completely over it. And I've been, it's time for me to do something else at this point. It really is. Cause I want better for my family and I want better for me. I want to be happy and going to work. I want to go, oh, I have to go to work today. Yay. I don't want to be like another freaking day. Like, I don't want to do that. And I don't want to feel like I settled either. So I don't know. I'm just going to continue to pray on it and see what comes out of it at this point. But. I'm going to get ready to go inside. I'm going to try to upload this video right now. If not, I'll upload it tonight when I get home. But you guys have a good, blessed Thursday. And uh, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. I know I don't have a lot of energy in today. Because I'm like, really like, this job is depressing. So, yeah. But anyway, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, guys.